Are you ready for some Jersey? Well, we've got Jersey. The zipper was made here. The light bulb was made here. The color television calls the Garden State home. Everybody wants to know about New Jersey. Sandy beaches, beautiful cities. We even have the Jersey Turnpike. Inventors, music, the movies. You need an exit? We got them too. You want Jersey? This is Jersey. Welcome to This is Jersey. The beautiful voice you're hearing belongs to Luca Fafano, Italian tenor and the voice of Venice. Already an established talent in Italy, he's come to New Jersey today and plans to begin recording music and touring in America. We have Luca's manager, Karen Ross, with us today to speak on his behalf and tell us why he will be a hit in America. Karen, thank you so much for coming here. Tell me, why is Luca here now? Luca is here to record his first solo album in the United States. He was offered a solo recording contract and we're very excited. He's a Venetian tenor and this is his first time in the USA and also his first solo album as he was part of a group in Europe signed with DECA UK but he was offered a recording contract and we're very excited. So I understand that he is like huge in Italy. Um, Italy, Monte Carlo, Monaco, Moscow. He, he's very big. He's done over 5,000 concerts in Italy. So what's his plan here in the US? Mostly to study English. He really needs to sharpen those skills and to record and he's done a lot of meet and greet, public relations, um, some small performances. He has the possibility of performing as a guest with the New York Philharmonic at the end of November and um, I think primarily recording studio time and English studies. You're speaking for him today because he doesn't speak English. Exactly. He does speak and he can understand and read but you have to speak very slowly for him to really get it. Mm -hmm. So I'm speaking for him today. Um, but he'll sing for himself. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> and that fine. says everything. Now, how did he get started in the music business? He started very young. He, um, his father brought him a guitar when he was a small child. He studied guitar and saxophone, but he always had a great voice. And from a very young age, he started a band in Italy, and that band still exists today with his friends. Mm -hmm. And then he started another typical Venetian. He also writes music, typical mm -hmm. Venetian music. And he has Orchestrana. They have albums in Italy. And then United Artists Warner did a huge project uh, all about Save Venice. And they went to Venice and they decided to interview and audition the 600 musicians living and working in Venice. And of those 600, they selected one tenor, one baritone, and one basso. And Luca was the tenor selected and they signed them to a mega contract with UK, UA, UK, mm -hmm. which became DECA. And they're fantastic, but they had no exposure in the United States. So he's always been in music, always. His whole life has been music. So what is he going to sing for us today? I think he'll sing O Solo Mio because America loves O Solo Mio. It's kind of like become the Italian national anthem. Che bella cosa è una giornata e sole Aria serena dopo una tempesta Bell'aria fresca Pare già una festa, che bella cosa è una giornata del sole. Manna del sole, che bella ne è, oh sole mio, sta in fronte a te. Quando a notte e a sole se ne scende, ma viene quasi una malinconia. Sotto a finestra taglia e resta ria. Quando a notte e a sole se 
نشنه ما Wow, that was, Bravo, that was fantastic. So he, he performs like that all over Italy, huh? All over Italy, solo, yes. Very nice. Well, that was great. Luca, thank you so much for being here. Good luck in America. And thank you for watching. We'll see you again next time.